Hey guys, what's up? Happy today is Saturday and welcome to this week or two's vlog. I'm not too sure what we're going to do this weekend. So I'm not too sure if it's going to be like a full vlog. So that might be a week or two. Anyways, we just went to Seven Leaves and they were out of boba. Um, and I ended up getting a half gallon of the mung bean drink that I get because why not? Luckily, I purchased some boba off Amazon last week and I was planning on making like my own drink anyways. So I'm going to make some boba right now to throw in to my seven leaves. A half gallon of the mung bean looks like. They're starting to float. are easy hairstyles that I don't really have to like do anything so for example like the robe curling TikTok trick where you just wrap your hair wake up and you have curly hair another hack that I like to do if I wash my hair super late at night I don't like to go to sleep with my hair wet because since I have bleach hair it'll just look so dry and crusty so I don't know how to French braid hair my mom does and that is one thing that I told myself I would like to learn out of this quarantine to be able to French braid my hair my mom French braided my hair. I left it in actually for a whole day. So I, she braided it at night. I wore braids for the whole day. And then the day after that, I took it out in. <laughs> Super easy hairstyle without having to actually use heat on your hair or have to curl it. So yeah. Anyways, I guess I will film my get under ready with me now. So that's a wrap for filming day. Um, not doing much else today. I think we are barbecuing again and just going to enjoy this Sunday. Another Sunday at home. Today is planter making day. So we went to Lowe's over the weekend and got this wood cut and Maynard is gonna make me a planter. Got the soil. Tomatoes, watermelon, and zucchini. Working hard. little garden more vegetables to come but this is my first vegetable garden so any tips will be greatly appreciated and it is so hot it's so hot I don't know why we decided to garden in the middle of the day when it's 90 degrees um, but yeah so my first garden if you guys have any tips or anything let me know because I've never gardened before with vegetables Plants, I'm okay. Vegetables. I am attempting to make Benihana style uh, fried rice. Never made it before, but I am craving like good fried rice. So I'm gonna make it with shrimp and I found the recipe on Pinterest. I hope everybody's doing well. I haven't vlogged in a few weeks. What's new with me? Ooh, I saw this thing where you can regrow your 
green onions by just putting it in like an inch of water. And this one was from three days ago. And there's already growth. So excited to see this. No updates on my avocado pits. I saw a video that actually the lady peeled the avocado pit. So I have one that is peeled and then the original two which are still not peeled. I picked apart my strawberry last night to get strawberry seeds. So I'm going to attempt to try to prop, um, germinate these strawberry seeds and see if anything comes out of them. And this is the finished look. It smells so good. Tonight we are making taro. Got both of these on Amazon. Boba and taro powder. You catch it. Catch the treat. A for effort. My camera settings were on the wrong setting, so it was so dark. Now I can see your face. This is what the taro powder looks like. It's like a light purple. Do you not like boba? What? Uh, homemade taro boba. Very taro, but it's like watered down taro. Nothing much other than, you know, listening and learning to everything that's going on. So I will post a link that has helped me in the description box below. It has a link to all of the places that you can donate, you can petition, it even has some tips if you're going to go to a protest and all of that. So make sure to check out the link below because that link was super helpful. It has a bunch of resources and I've learned a lot from all of it. But I wanted to show you something really cool that I bought from Target and it's this rolling cart. I know. As you get older, like these are the things that you get excited about. It's a really cute rolling cart. And the reason why I got it is because Right now I'm filming in the room next to my room and that's where I usually keep everything. Um, so when I'm filming and after I'm done filming, especially if I'm filming like a tutorial or a favorites video or anything like that, I usually have to make like four or five trips because like my camera gear, my background, all of the products that I just used in my video. So I got this really cute cart from Target to house everything. Let me show you. It has three shelves, which like I said, today is a light filming day, so I don't really have much on here. My diamond art, which has been super relaxing. I'll show you guys this later, but you basically, it's like, it's like paint by numbers, but like you add little beads on it. I just keep it on there. The second shelf, I just keep my equipment. So my camera, my light batteries, my camera battery. This just has like some cords and some random camera accessories. These are my battery chargers. And then down here, I kept this backdrop and then just my plain backdrop here. And then I'll usually, I'll put like, I mean, it's not a perfect fit, but at least I don't have to make multiple trips. And I'll just put everything on here. We wheel it back.
You like the garden? Hey guys, we just picked up some cookies from Lukey's Cookies. Oh, it's taped. Hold on. Hi. Get Ube Crinkle. Ube Crinkle and then the cookies and cream. I'm so excited. Today's an extra good day because we got a bench and the actual dumbbell weights that we didn't have to pay $2,000 for. So excited! Cookies and weights. So if we'll work off those cookies. Cookies and cream on a Chipotle napkin because you know, ah! Because you know if you've been to Chipotle, you take all their napkins. But oh my God! Is your face okay? get a cookie always we got adjustable dumbbells we've been working out with resistance bands only and a bench oh my god do you like it clay do you like it okay test it out hopefully it doesn't break How does it feel to work out with actual weights? Weird. Your nipples out. Well, it's been what, three months since we've been to the gym yep. and work out with actual weights. The only weight we had was a, tw a 12 pound dumbbell. Clay. Zoomies. Oh my god. Stay on my ceiling garden. Um, look at these green onions. This is my first time regrowing them and look at how crazy. Like, they're so long. This one cracked two days ago and I don't know. Oh my God, my camera's not focusing. But you can see the root starting to come through. So, I'm gonna go ahead and peel these two. Now on to germinating some stuff for my garden outside. I handpicked some oh I handpicked seeds from my strawberries so we'll see if this works I bought some cabbage and cucumber seeds so, drop a couple seeds oh. I have my assistant here. Are you helping me plant the seeds? Morning! We're gonna go check the garden. This is what the garden's looking like. We had to put this mesh over it because we have problems with squirrels and birds eating our veggies. So put this little mesh over it for now. Probably build something so it doesn't like hang on the plants. But yeah exciting i just came in here to mist my germinating seeds and look this is only two days this is the cabbage and it's already starting to sprout finally it's been three months since we've touched real weights seeds five days ago now so this one is cabbage 
cucumber. This one is strawberry seeds. Are taking a little bit longer. Um, but I'm so excited. It grew so fast. So I purchased this thing on Amazon and it's like a greenhouse type thing. And every morning I just kind of spritz it with water. Hey guys, I just wanted to come on here and close out the vlog for this month. Pretty much the end of the month already. Honestly, I don't remember what I've vlogged throughout the month. I kind of just vlogged um, bits and pieces here and there. So this is pretty much a June recap of some things that I have been doing during the month. I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope these vlogs are somewhat entertaining. Um, it's kind of cool for me to be able to like look back on the month and see what I've done. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Until the next one. Bye guys.